Hi everyone, my name is Blake Bejarano, and today I'm going to show you how to make a chat room inside of the CoCalc platform. You can see I'm at CoCalc.com. I'm going to head over to my projects. Now I can select the project that I'd like to work inside of. Projects are Docker containers. You can create multiple projects with different sets of collaborators to determine who has access to what files. I'm going to go ahead and click on my project. And now you can see my file system. One thing that I'd want to go ahead and quickly note is that if I would like to add a collaborator, um, you can click on the user panel in the action bar on the left hand side and add their email address and then they'll have access to the file system. And this is how you can collaborate with folks inside of a chat room. So you can access that chat file inside of your Linux file sharing system. And to make that chat room, we'll head over to the plus new button. And then here I'm going to name this chat. Scroll down and click on chat room underneath the teaching and chat section. And here I am, I'm off to the races and I can at my colleagues. I can also use GPT, Gemini, Mistral, or Claude 3 directly inside of the chat as well. Um, but here, maybe just as a quick example, I want to use this WYSIWYG editor. You can use bold, italicize, underline, strike through, etc. You can drag and drop images. You can uh, use links or have different colors. It's a really great editor for folks that are maybe a bit unfamiliar with formatting like Markdown or LaTeX. But we also support those folks. So here, what you can do is click on the Markdown button. So this will make a quick switch to the UI and you can write using markdown formatting. Maybe here I wanna make an intro, have a quick line. And then underneath that, I wanna have a checkbox and some LaTeX. Sigma minus new is equal to gamma. And you can get that nice preview by switching back to the rich text view. But that is a quick tip and trick on using the CoCalc UI. Please like, subscribe and follow for more and I will see you next time. Thanks again.